Hey, 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 Royal fans, thank you for joining me today. Let's get into today's Royal headline. Royal Insight, Queen's confession on Prince Harry's overexposure before Megxit. Last week, Meghan Markle and Prince Harry appeared at a joint engagement, the couple's first from their new home in Santa Barbara. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex participated in a Zoom call with the Queen's Commonwealth Trust to discuss using digital technologies as a force for good. This is the first time the couple have appeared together from their new home. Despite reports claiming Meghan is enjoying life in California, many fans of the couple are saddened by their relocation and decision to step down as senior members of the royal family. Harry used to be the most popular royal after the Queen, and his wedding to the former Suits actress in 2018 became the most watched television event of the year. Unearthed reports, though, suggest the monarch was perfectly aware of the risks involved in overexposing her grandson. According to a throwback report by The Telegraph, when Prince Harry represented the Queen at the Olympic closing ceremony in 2012, there were excitable talks among public relations, men that the royal family had made a conscious decision to deploy him more prominently to reach out to younger generations. This was not the case, though. The report read, The Queen is nothing if not an insightful boss of the firm, and she seemed only too well aware before Prince Harry's eventful trip to Las Vegas. That, too, much exposure for him. In any sense of the word, would not necessarily be prudent. When asked if Prince Harry would have taken on a more prominent role in order to give the royal family a bit more street cred, among the young, a Buckingham Palace spokesman told the publication, no, not at all. The spokesman added, the royal family has the ability to transcend the generations. As the Queen and the Prince of Wales demonstrate daily in their work, in relation to the Olympic closing ceremony, owing to others' commitments and the neat fact that Prince Harry had met the mayor of Rio, the next host city. Recently, he ended up being the most senior member of the royal family present. The spokesman conceded that the Olympic closing ceremony was a more informal occasion than an opening, which the Queen had attended, but stressed that Prince Harry had himself been keen to participate in the event. Oh, what a wonderful news story, huh? Guys, I hope you liked it. Thank you for watching. Thank you for always coming and watching our videos. It really means a lot to me. If you enjoyed today's content, give us a like, leave us a comment, and of course, don't forget to subscribe. While you're at it, hit that bell icon for the latest updates and turn the notifications on so you never miss news when we release them. Goodbye for now.